Tampa Bay in Carolina, fresh off that humiliating loss, one of Tom Brady's worst games of his career. What was his passer rating in that one? 40.4. A 40.4 passer rating for Tom fucking Brady. Oh my gosh, that is horrible. 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 Tampa Bay, you got absolutely embarrassed last week. Will this be a bounce back against another division rival? Could be a tough one. Carolina, five, point, five and a half point home underdogs. All of their losses have been by eight points or less going back to last season. The Bucs, they're two and four against spread in their last six games, four and two against spread versus Carolina. They're five and ten straight up versus Carolina. Two and six against spread versus the NFC South. They're eight and one straight up versus teams with losing records, though. Uh, the road team is nine and four against spread in the head to head series, while the under is hit in five of the seven games in Carolina when these two teams face each other. The Panthers, they're 5-0 against spread as an underdog, 5-2 against spread their last seven, 3 and 14 straight up their last 17 games, 1-7 straight up at home this year, or in their last eight. Bridgewater, he is the spread buster, 32-11 against spread, 22-5 against spread as a dog in his career. Those are just outstanding numbers. Nobody even comes close to him when you look at the percentages and break down who's in second. I can't remember now who's in second. I did this research a couple weeks ago and I've just carried the numbers forward as we have gone. McCaffrey's out, which means the Panthers will be getting a lot. The Bucks, I mean, will be taking most of the money, I'm guessing. But I like Carolina to cover the spread. I think Curtis Samuel, he's going to get a lot of touches at running back and at wide receiver, and he had a huge game at wide out last week for Carolina. I think Carolina does enough to hang around in this game, and they could even sneak the upset. I'm not going to pick them. I'm going to pick Tampa to win, Carolina to cover. I think this is going to be within three points no matter who wins this game.